Hey guys, uh, I'm getting set up for a video shoot today and I just want to go through a quick two-part warm-up that I like to do uh, with other people. Granted, nobody's here now, but for me, I often don't have too much time before something like this, before a video session. So I'm just trying to hit two birds with one stone, as they say, and combine flexibility and long tones together, try to get air moving, trying to get the sound going, trying to get everything going as soon as possible. So here we go with an exercise that I borrowed from one of my uh, teachers, the great uh, Steve Ture. He showed this to us when I was studying with him at Juilliard. And I've been doing it ever since and working with students on it uh, ever since. I'm gonna play one uh, part of it and then I'll have you guys are gonna play the accompanying part. So I'll show you the two parts. So we're thinking in half notes and we're thinking in scale degrees. What I'm gonna do, the first part goes five, one, four, one, five, or sound like this. And the other part is one, five, one, four, one. So if you need to, take a chance and pause the video and figure those two things out. We have the part A, which is 51415, and part B, which is 15141. Now what we're going to do is we're going to start in the key of B flat, which is what I just played, and we're going to go down chromatically to E. So what we're going to do, so you guys are going to play part A, and I'm going to play part B, and we're going to put half note, half note, half note, half note, whole note, and bar in between, and then we're going to go down chromatically. Here we go. One, two, three, four. thing I would do is I would return back to B flat major where we started and we do the same pattern except instead of going down this time we're going to go up and this time we're going to go up for a full octave. One, two, three. <laughs>
we go a full octave. So some things to think about when you're doing this exercise is, this is like a long tone and a flexibility exercise combined into one. You know, we're trying to save time and give some motion to our long tones. So what we're gonna think about is one long tone with motion, even though we're changing pitches. So try to think, Di -da 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 -da, as you're playing part A. <clears throat> and then make sure that you're tuning really carefully to the B part. Today is with me, it could be with a friend on another day, just to make sure we're playing in tune together. So happy practicing on this. I hope this helps you warm up quickly right before you have something to go do.